A handy feature in Rapid Weaver that a lot of users don't know about is being able to individually publish a page. So obviously we have the uh, main publish button up here where you can publish all of the changes to your site up to your live server. However, if you right click on one of your pages here, you'll see a publish page. And what that will do is literally publish just the changes for this page. So let me show you that in action very quickly. If I were to make a change to the about page, let's say that we just add a header into the top of here, just for an example. And maybe I add a paragraph as well. Like so, I'm working on this page, I've made the changes, uh, and then I'm gonna perhaps go and make an events, uh, sorry, perhaps I'm gonna make a change to the events page as well. Let's just add a paragraph of text in below here. So I've got two pages where I've uh, made changes. However, let's say you're working on a client site and you get a phone call through and they say, I want those changes to the about page to go live. But you're in the middle of working on the events page. You haven't quite finished those changes yet. You need a bit more time. What you don't want to do is press the publish button up here because what that will do is go and publish all of the changes to all of the pages. And we don't want that because we don't want this events page to be updated just yet. So what we would do is go to the about page and click on publish page. What that will do is export just the about page and publish the changes to that page. And then what you'll see is that the change marker has gone from the about page, but we still have the events page marked as being changed. And that is because, as I say, RapidWeaver hasn't published the changes to this page. Okay, so that is the handy little feature of publishing individual pages in RapidWeaver 7. Hope you liked the video and I'll see you again soon.